we didn't know that there was a real issue because there was no bargaining, no negotiation with these employees. And having spoken to them when a rumor appeared, they said that everything was fine, except for other minor things that do not have to do directly with civil aviation. It's more promotions and so that has to go to the Ministry of the Public Service. And, but I must say openly that it created a black eye on, on Belize. Uh, the confidence with the airlines in the country and the airlines. This is not about a, a small group. It is not about a political party. This is about Belize, the future and the bread and butter of the majority of, of people that have to do with this industry. So I see it irresponsible and negligent on the part of, of uh, my employees. I've always had an open door with an uh, employee telling them that if there is problems with my director, my CEO, they can always come to this minister and I will definitely listen. Out of the 14 flight, only United canceled the, their flights totally. All the other flights were here and the, the, everybody was almost transported to their destination except, if I am not wrong, two persons that stayed. No? There were 19, the other, the other 17 managed to get another airline uh, and go to their destination. So I'm very thankful for the cooperation of, of the concession group, for the cooperation also Mr. Koyi that works over there. He, he was always on hand and he is witness to say that he tried to call these people on their phone, nobody would answer. Everybody reported sick, very, very, very strange. No? But nonetheless, there are, never, uh, there are dialogues with these people and we are hoping that uh, everything can come back to normal. Will these employees face any kind of disciplinary um well, you know, there is always a process, there is always an investigation. And as I told Giovanni, that, in, in, that in, I am not saying that everything is fine, but I am saying we will negotiate, we will investigate. But with me, I'm not saying this one will be fired or the other, because I don't know what are the circles. But what I am saying, that within my ministry, if there is negligence on the part of anyone, I have to deal with the, the issue. You cannot have people that are negligible in working with any institution and particularly my concern have always been the safety of the people, the safety of the passengers, the safety of the industry and I have made it clear when it comes to safety there is no negotiations when it comes to safety.